Hi, I'm Joe Miles. I stopped by the job site today to check out an installation of a Marvin Integrity casement window. What I really like about this Ultrax exterior is that it's incredibly durable. Because it's fiberglass, it has much less expansion and contraction than vinyl, for example. Um, therefore, over time, it's going to hold up much better. The acrylic coating on top of the um, Ultrax is also incredibly durable. What we're here to talk about today is the new casing from Integrity. This product is new from Marvin and it is, uh, we're really excited about it for, for a number of reasons. First of all, it's just the general durability of the Ultrax product itself. It's incredibly strong. Uh, the acrylic finish on this casing is incredibly durable and it's really great looking. Best of all, this casing is easy to assemble. Let's take a look. Install Integrity wood or all Ultrax window or door following manufacturer's recommended installation instructions and local building code requirements. Weatherproof your newly installed Integrity window or door following manufacturer's recommended instructions and local building code requirements. Locate a clean and flat workspace appropriately for the pre-assembly of your Integrity exterior casing solution. Locate tools, fasteners, and caulk as identified in the tools and supplies section of the installation instructions that came with your new Integrity exterior casing. Locate the pre-cut trim kit that corresponds to the window or door that you are planning to apply trim to. Each kit is packaged separately. Open the kit and examine the contents to ensure all parts and pieces are present. Contact RK Miles with any questions or concerns. Following the enclosed instruction sheet, lay out the lineal pieces of casing or subsill face down on your clean and flat workspace. Insert corner keys in all four corners. Do not secure with screws at this point. If using flat casing or sill nosing option, locate and place into place appropriate end caps. Secure end caps into place with supplied number seven three quarter inch pan head screws. Reticulated foam block should be applied to sill end cap prior to fastening. One thing we're recommending is to use a drill with a clutch so you don't overdrive the screws instead of using an impact drill. Fasten each corner key into place using supplied number seven three quarter inch pan head screw. Install the outside 90 degree screws first, followed by the inside 60 degree angled screws. Fasten until joints are tight, taking care not to over tighten screws, which could cause damage to screw channel. Pre-assembly of your integrity casing kit is now complete. Locate the appropriate number of casing connection barbs supplied with the casing kit. We find pre-drilling the connection barbs really helps with alignment. Apply casing connection barbs to the perimeter of the unit using the step in the profile to align with the window or door frame with a minimum spacing of two and a half inches and a maximum of four inches from each corner. Two number eight one inch stainless steel pan head screws are recommended for each connection barb. Apply a 3 16 bead of sealant to the entire width of the window sill, window only, at the bottom edge of the sill. Line up pre-assembled exterior casing to the corresponding window or door unit. Beginning in the upper left hand corner and working in a clockwise motion, press the casing into the connection barb until all four corners have been engaged. Continue this pattern until the casing inside edge contacts the window frame. You have now successfully installed your new Integrity exterior casing.